here from the NDSU Extension Service. Today, we're going to show you how to create tasty freezer meals to save you time and money. Many of your favorite recipes can be used as a freezer meal. Otherwise, NDSU Extension and other Extension websites have some great resources for recipes. Once your recipes are selected, check what you already have on hand and then make your shopping list. Now, don't forget your freezer bags and your labeling tools such as a permanent marker. So we're going to go ahead and move forward with oven baked chicken strips. This is my flour, salt and pepper together, my two eggs, and then my panko crumbs. Now if you don't have panko crumbs, you can certainly use bread crumbs. So all you do is you just dip your chicken strips into your flour and go ahead and dip it into your eggs. And they're always so nice and goopy, those eggs and into your panko strips. You get a nice good even coating on it. And then we're just going to place it on, you can either use wax paper or parchment paper, and then we're going to put it in the freezer, and then once those are froze, we're going to put them into our freezer bags. Okay, we've got our oven baked chicken strips that we've had in the freezer for about 30 to 60 minutes. They're pretty well frozen enough for what we need. And I have my bag here, it's already marked with the date what the recipe is and how to cook or bake your chicken strips. So I'm just going to place these into the bag and these will be so nice when I'm um, kind of come home don't really know what I'm going to make or just very busy. I'm just going to pop these in the oven. It'll take about 30 to 35 minutes and then I can just fix a couple of sides with it whether it's a salad or a side of vegetables and what I'm doing right now is again just squeezing this air out to prevent, help prevent freezer burn. Again, we want to use up our freezer meals in about three months for the best quality. And there you go. And they're nice and flat. Quick, easy meal.